Asking Command, Major General Brian S. Eifler, and Aerospace Medical Service Functional Manager for the 673rd Medical Group, Chief Master Sergeant Amy Miller. Please take your seats. It is our sacred duty to honor the memory of the fallen from that fateful day. We honor the innocent lives lost in the carnage, our first responders who ran into it, and our citizens that went down fighting back. We also honor those that gave their lives in the response to defense of America. From 9-11 to the present, over 7,000 members of the military have made the ultimate sacrifice. Over 53,000 were wounded, and hundreds of thousands that still bear the internal scars of war. Today, we honor them. We honor fathers and mothers who gave sons and daughters we honor children, many whose only memory is a framed photo of their parent. And we honor the brothers and sisters of our armed forces, bonded forever to the crucible of combat. On this day, we must commit to continue to honor them all through our selfless service to our nation and by taking care of the families of the fallen taking care of our veterans. We must take care of each other and give hope to the hopeless. We must never accept defeat and never quit. We must energetically be ready to fight and win our nation's wars. I am proud to serve with all of you. You are America's best. For you had many choices and despite the hazards of our profession, you courageously chose to serve. And tell America, I got your back. I thank God for you all. May God bless you. God bless our great nation. And as we remember our fallen and our commitment to the future, please stand and join me in a moment of silence. <laughs> 